Let's go do baby chick chores together. They get it messy in there real quick, but let's start off with the water. Change their water about three times a day, but it's never enough. The rocks are to keep the baby chicks from taking a swim and accidentally drowning. Next, I check their food levels and clean up all of the little wood chips that they kick in there. They're getting more bigger, so I have to refill more often. Now it's time to clean the brooder box. They really like hopping on and pooping. I've tried covering this up with paper towels and parchment paper, but the baby chicks actually just pull it off and play with it. Once a week, I'll completely change out their bedding, but in the meantime, I just go in and I give their bedding a nice stir and pull up the fresh bedding up top. The chickies don't mind it. Sometimes they scratch in it as soon as I stir it up. Hey, I'm not done yet. <laughs> the heating plate goes back in once I've stirred up all the bedding. I almost forgot to add a little bit of apple cider vinegar in their water. Just the splash. The apple cider vinegar will give them probiotics in their gut, which will make them a lot more healthier. Now it's time to clean up the little dusting area. They love to throw all these chips in here. That one is not really scared of my hand. Come on. Come on. Hi, cutie pie. You're the only one that's brave enough to come near my hand. Now that I finished cleaning their dusting area, they're gonna get some grass. Hi. Go and get it. You know you want it. <laughs> It's part of a good, healthy diet for them to have more than just grains. Some grass is good. All done. I just finished washing my hands because I did touch a little bit of chicky poo. And now my reward is I get to see them.